Not everyone considers themselves an artist. But with the right challenge, you may really surprise yourself. <sighs> you think you're pretty, huh? I'll draw you even more spectacular. Channeling my inner Van Gogh. He'd love by use of lines. These hooves are tricky. There! Not quite what I was going for. Uh, what are we looking at? Let's try this again, shall we? Uh, you again? Third time's a charm, right? This one's gonna be it. I can feel it. Don't even say it. Here we go. Oh, this is the worst one yet. I'll never be a famous artist. This muse was anything but inspiring. Now what do I do? Hey, wait a minute. That shadow is incredible. This is gonna be easy now. Cast the light on your subject. And just outline that shadow on paper. I'm capturing every bump and groove. And the horns. And that's how it's done. Now to get creative with some color. Nothing like a fresh set of markers, right? They fill in the color quite nicely. Almost finished with this one. Almost forgot about this end. I wonder if Van Gogh knew about this trick. Nice! Hey! I just can't escape you? Hmm, where on earth do I begin? Green is the ultimate color of tranquility. Which is perfect for my vision. Very nice. Voila! Hmm, this simply won't cut it. I need a nice clean slate. Maybe this blue hue is better. Yes, it's looking better already. Oh, now we're talking. Why can't I get this thing right? A waste of a canvas. Time to kick this into high gear! Going the realist route this time! Steady... And... Ha! My hands have failed me again! Oh, I'm just not cut out for this artist's life! Why is this happening? Why, oh unknowable universe, why? What a day! Even my hair is betraying me. Wait! The answer was right in my pocket! First, put down these strips of tape. Then you get a triangle. Next comes the paint. Put it down in globs. Just like this. And you can choose any colors you want. Just make sure they fit inside. This paint's thick. Now for the really cool part. Zigzag the comb up and down as you go through the paint. It's okay if it gets on the tape. Now fill in the rest of the white space. Yep, use nice big globs. The bottom may take a tad longer, since you have more space to fill in. But don't worry, it'll all be worth it at the end. Time to pull back all that tape. Just look at that clean line. Two more to go. And the perfect colorful triangle. 
all that's left to do now is admire my masterpiece. Guess I am a true artist after all. Alright, kitty. You ready to see an artist in action? This one's gonna be really good. After all, the more colors, the merrier. <sighs> Just a few more hues to go. My hand's getting tired here. It turned out great! Or maybe not. I can't do anything right. What's happening over there? Color blending, I see. I can definitely work with that. Check out that epic gradient! Wow! Now to blend just the right shades. <laughs> it's like a little marker smooch. And then there's color magic. I wonder what this one will look like. Nothing like a fun color-changing unicorn. Look at it! This part ought to be good. like a unicorn rainbow over here. I can't even color it fast enough. Every section can be a new color gradient. See how it all comes together? Careful around the snout. Very nice. Now this is a real improvement. <laughs> Don't you agree? get started on this assignment. A rainbow, huh? There's red in rainbows, right? Next up, yellow. This is looking pretty snazzy. Mm, but this shape is kind of funky. This one should be better. But why is it so straight? Come on! Curve! Curve! This is impossible! Everything okay in here? Huh, you tell me! <laughs> here, let me help you. <laughs> Drawing rainbows is hard, man! Do you wanna help? Oh yeah! Just watch! Place a strip of tape down, sticky side up. And put your markers, in order, on top. Then wrap the tape back over. There! One rainbow coming right up. <laughs> One big swoop on the page is all it takes. The perfect curve. See? That looks unbelievable! I'll try! Someone's getting an A on this assignment. See ya! Hungry? Um, Chloe? What happened in here? Whoa, I've never seen so many rainbows! They're everywhere! Chloe? This trick really got me going! Wanna make some more with me? Chocolate? How'd you know I was hungry? Here! Ah, what a lovely day. It's just so nice to be out in nature. What do you think? Wow, it's amazing! Here's my painting. I'm so happy with it. Really? Uh, okay. Wait, do you hear that? Yeah, it's… It's a bee! Ah! Leave us alone! Shoo! Shoo! Uh-oh, Lexi? No, what's it doing? Is it gone? Whoa, this is pretty cool. So what happens now? Bzzz. Well, hello there. Is that a giant talking bee? What is it doing? Mmm, that's one tasty-looking sandwich! But it's missing honey! Look at that sweet, sweet goodness! I can't wait! I'm gonna enjoy this! Hang on! Ooh, so sticky! I need to get rid of these gloves! 
That's better. This is so weird. Can we just get on with it? Hello? I need your help. Yeah, right now. Wow! Express delivery! Let's see what we've got! Ooh, more gloves! Wait, this gives me an idea! Hey, you two! Catch! Uh, yellow is not my color. What are we supposed to do with these? Ah, the perfect fit! I want you to make a Pokemon! With a glove? Hmm, this might be tricky. I'm not really sure what to do. But I'll give it a try. I'll blow up the glove. Then I'll tie a knot in it. It's looking good. But there's more to do. I'll fold the middle two fingers down. I'll need some tape. I'll use it to hold them in place. Now I can flip the glove over. I'll do the same with another glove. I'll stick them together. Next, I'll need a balloon. I want to wrap it around the gloves. I need to be gentle with this part. I don't want to burst the balloon. These will be the arms. I'll need another balloon for the tail. I'll stick it to the back of the gloves. Now I'll draw a circle on the top glove. This is gonna be the eye. I'll give him a nose. And then a big happy smile. Now I'll do the ears. I just want to color a small section. Oh yeah! Pikachu needs rosy cheeks. These are easy. It's just two red circles. I'll make sure they're in the same spot. There. That should do it. It looks just like Pikachu. Hey, little guy! <laughs> Check it out! Wow, that's amazing! You made that from a glove? I guess I have a new friend. What are you gonna do? I don't know. Mmm, that's good. Wait! I know! I've got it! Let's make Pikachu! I'll start with two googly eyes. I'll press them onto the glove. I have two felt stickers. These will be the cheeks. I'll color two fingers with a black pen. Now I'll insert the drinks cup. I'll fold the glove around the lip. Now I'll turn the cup over. I'll need a scalpel. I'll make two small cuts in the cup. Then I'll push a drinking straw through it. There's only one more thing to do. I'll tuck the glove into the cup. I'll put it right in there. That's it! Now I need to blow into the straw. Then out pops Pikachu! Ta-da! No! Don't you dare! Stay back! I know karate! Aw, why would you do that? That is a real mean bee. Aw, look at it. I worked so hard on this. It's so unfair. <laughs> it's okay, Meg. Don't be sad. But that means I might win. Mmm, this is an easy decision. Lexi wins. Woo! Congratulations. Whoa! I love this channel. It's my favorite. Ha! <laughs> Tina's so funny! Uh-oh! Look out! That was uncalled for. Come on, it was hilarious! <laughs> anyway, I've got something to show you. It's my chicken! It's pretty cute, huh? You actually like that? Yeah, why? I prefer poppets. They're so much more fun. Poppets? They're so last year. It's all about chickens now. Nope. Poppets are the best. And your chicken has stupid hair. Oh no you didn't! I would do it again. My chicken's hair is beautiful. It's so fashionable. Oh no it's… Wait! So it's like that, is it? Two can play that game. I feel so glamorous. That color doesn't suit you. Stop arguing. Oops, sorry. <laughs> Try and relax. This is your next challenge. Icky yucky bugs. Okay, I'm sure we can do that. Whoa, where did that come from? Look at all those things. We can definitely make something cool with them. Wait, do we need to share this? I saw it first! It's mine! Hands off! I better get started. I have a plan. First, I need to draw a butterfly. Wow, sometimes I impress myself. Now I need to cut it out. I don't need these small pieces. I'll clear them away. Oh, that's a good idea. I can use a spoon. I want to snap off the handle. Then I'll apply glue to the wing. I'll stick the spoon to it. I'll do this all the way around. I'm glad I bought that extra large bag of disposable spoons. Now I'll put glue on the head. I'll put it on the body as well. That should be enough. Now I'll use a brush to spread it out. I can't forget about the antenna. I'll do the same on the body. 
all need glitter now. I'll sprinkle it over the glue. Wow! I love that color! I'll dab glue onto the spoons. I don't need a lot of glue. Just a light coating. I don't want to miss any spoons. Then I'll sprinkle over more glitter. I'm using a different color. I need to work quickly. I don't want the glue to set. I'll use purple glitter for the outer spoons. That's it! I'll shake off the excess glitter. It's so colorful! Yay! That does look good. It's okay to be jealous. It's over to you. Ooh. Okay, take it easy. I'm sure I can beat that. I'll draw a circle on a piece of cardboard. Then I'll cut it out. Hello, Meg! Nah, nah. That was childish, but it was funny. I'll punch holes in the circle. I want to make eight holes. I'll make four on each side. Just like this. Now I'll thread a zip tie through one of the holes. I'll fasten it, but I want to leave a small loop. That's perfect! Next, I'll drizzle glue onto the cardboard. I can use a brush to spread it out. I want to go right to the edge. Then I'll pour glitter over it. I'm using a dark purple glitter. It's ideal for what I'm doing. Then I'll add a pair of eyes. I'll get rid of the loose glitter. I'm finished! I made a cute spider! It even has a web. Look out! It's on the move! Have you ever seen such an adorable spider? Where's it going? Ah! Ugh! You're so annoying. It was just a joke. Wait! Spider! Ah! Get rid of it! Okay, that was scary. Ooh, I know her! Really? You hang out with a spider? It's judging time! Let me see your artwork! It's a tie! Well done! You both did great! I'm getting emotional! Yes! I won again! We both won! I wonder what we'll do this time. I want you to make a pretty flower. Us bees love flowers. Go for it! Whoa, check it out! Are those eggs? I'm so confused. Yeah, what do those have to do with flowers? I don't get it. A little help? Don't look at me. Hey, B, What's the deal? Hold on. Hey, those are mine! I've been looking for them. Give me that basket. Aw, we needed those. So long, losers. Not so fast! Let it go! Now this is entertaining! It's so hypnotic! Take your stripey hands off! You mess with the wrong bee! Take that! Ah, my bunny butt! Hop off! Ooh. Phew, I was getting worried. Aw, look at the eggs! We can't use them. Sorry, girls. But you can use the shells! Yeah, that's not any clearer. You want us to make flowers out of this? Hmm, we we'll need to think about this. Wait, I think I know what to do! Yeah, I've got it! I'll need this shell. It needs to be pretty much intact. Then I'll stick a soda cap to the bottom. Now I need a brush and glue. I'll start to apply the glue to the shell. Okay, that's the first part done. Now I'll pour glitter over it. Wow, it looks great! You'd never know it was an eggshell. I'll put a flower into it. It's a cute little flower vase. Hey Meg, have a look at this. Nice, huh? I love it, Lexi. I made more. They're better than boring old vases. I could look at them all day. Hmm. What am I gonna do? I mean, it's an eggshell. There's not much you can do. Ooh, inspiration has struck. Let's do this. I'll give the shell a coat of paint. I'm using this lovely blue. I'll let the paint dry. Then I'll smash the shell. Ooh, that got rid of my tension. Next, I need a piece of paper and a pen. I'll sketch out a vase. This is the easy part. Now I need more glue. I'll apply it inside the vase. That should be enough! I'll need tweezers for this next part. I'll stick the broken eggshell to the paper. I'll start with the big pieces. I'll arrange them randomly. Then I'll start to fill in the gaps. I don't want any white spaces. I can use paint to fill it. This vase needs something in it. I'll use a brown pen to draw branches and stems. Then I'll draw leaves. I won't put them on every branch. Hmm, I think it needs more color. I'll use modeling clay for this next part. I've cut small circles from red clay. I'll arrange them in a larger circle. The tweezers mean I won't squash them. Now I'll press a line into the clay. I'm using a sculpting tool for this, and I'll use yellow clay in the middle. It's a beautiful flower! This can go onto my picture. I'll make different sized flowers. 
Wow, it's amazing! I'm so happy with how this turned out. But I'm still not done. I'll add a little B to it. Maybe it'll get me bonus points. I need to do anything I can to win. I can color the B in now. It looks like someone I know. I hope they're flattered. Okay, I'll admit that's pretty good. It's ready! There's something so soothing about flowers. I want to put this in my room. Let's find out who's won! We're finished! What do you think? <laughs> I like them both, but one has a beautiful bee in it. Meg wins! It's excellent, Meg! Oh yeah, I knew that would work. But I made pretty vases! Time for the final round! Everything's to play for! Give me a second! Your next challenge is a rainbow! They're so magical! Rainbows always make me happy! Ooh, look at that! I'll take the pens! I've got a great idea! I can't wait to get started! I'll take this cotton pad. Then I'll draw on it. I'm gonna make the rainbow. It's so simple! I just need to get all the colors in order. That's it! How's that? My very own rainbow! Am I supposed to be impressed? Uh, yeah? Okay, let's try this again. I just need to grab something. These bowls will be useful. I just need to set them up. There we go. Now I'll take the jug of water. I'll pour water into each of the bowls. Careful, I don't want to spill any. I don't have time to clean up. This is the last one. Now for the magic to happen. I'll place the cotton pad in the water. The colors will start to seep. I'll draw different things on the pads, like a butterfly. And a pretty flower. And it looks so good! Just look at those colors mixing! It's a rainbow in a bowl! Wow, you're like a wizard! I suppose I am! Hey! Beat that! Hmm, what should I do? Oh, I know! I'll need some bowls too. Don't worry, I'm not copying you. I'm gonna need the water. Come on, hand it over! Thanks. At least there's some left. I'll pour it into the bowls. This looks familiar. Just wait. Now I'll need the food coloring. I'll start with the blue. I'll add a few drops to the bowl. Then I'll put red coloring in the second bowl. And finally, yellow in the third bowl. Now I need to get artistic. I'm gonna draw a face. Look at those lashes! I need to know their secret. I can't believe I'm jealous of a drawing. Now I can add the rest of the features. I'll draw love heart for the lips. Then I'll make some freckles. This might be some of my best work. Okay, it's time to color it. I'll use pink for the lips. I need to stay in the lines. I don't want to ruin it now. Then I'll use blusher on the cheeks. That's just what I want. Now I'll place cotton pads at the top of the drawing and along the side of the face. This is gonna be the hair. It's like a wig. Mm, it looks pretty ordinary. I keep this dropper handy for emergencies. This'll make all the difference. I'll fill it with the blue water. Then I'll squeeze it over the pads. I'll drop it into the middle of them. I'll do both sides. Then I'll do the same with the yellow water. I'll let it soak into the pads. Next, I'll drip the red water onto them. I also made up green water. Wow! This is one colorful hairstyle! It's giving me ideas for my next trip to the salon! Now I'll let the pads dry. It gives it a great effect. It's so creative! It's not bad. But we're not the ones doing the judging. It's over to you! You keep astounding me. Meg wins this one! Woohoo! I knew it! I think that's the right decision. These pictures are hilarious! <laughs> What's that lady drawing? She's so serious! You kids think painting is easy? Sounds like you need a reality check. Oh! What? How'd we get over here? At least we're together, right? Sweet, huh? Want to give it a try? How hard can a heart be? Just a couple of curved lines. Haven't drawn one of these in a while. Let's try this again. One curve here. Ugh, I'm terrible at this. I can't make the sides even! This is gonna take me forever! But maybe this grid could help! I can use each square, going down a peg again and again… That covers the bottom half! <sighs> now on to the top! It's prettier with the different colors! 
Just a few more. It's awesome! Check it out! What a unique approach! And this one... A tad literal for my taste. <laughs> I think Matt really nailed this round. Oh yeah! Ugh. What's taking her so long? Almost done! Your patience has paid off! Ta-da! That looks kind of fun! Drawing a boy is super easy! I look at one in the mirror every day! So good! Where'd Ellie learn to do all that? Oh, I can't turn this in! Matt, you don't have time! Let's see those pictures! I gotta think really fast here! There! A boy! Huh? I guess that is a boy. Oh, wait! Let me make one little adjustment. Fine, but just one minute. Thank you! These letters are a great starting point. First, just link them all together. See? It's coming together! And a little color makes it alive. Aw, he's kinda cute! Ha! Take that, art challenge! It's a masterpiece! What do you think? Two Picassos in training! I knew we could do it! Meow! Mesmerized, huh? Hmm, well snap out of it! We have to draw a cat? Okay, I guess. This is tricky. Any day now. Whiskers? I could use a little inspiration. Hmm, is she really asleep? Now I can really get to work. Say goodbye, little kitty. You're coming with me. Hey, Ellie. How'd you get that? So unfair! I want one too! But I can be clever too. Ah, good boy. I prefer the real deal. Aww. Mwah. I've done it again. You're my very best friend. And I'm gonna draw you too. You're bigger than I anticipated. Uh, I can't trace you at all. Maybe if you turn just a bit. This isn't working. What a happy accident! You know how to spell cat! Matt! Hold him for a sec? Where'd you come from? Anyway... Let's do this! <sighs> Much better! Time to turn the word cat into... Something a little more cat-like! I'll make this little guy brown! Don't forget the ears! And perhaps a few fun stripes! Almost as cute as the real thing! <laughs> what do you think? Anybody home over there? What'd I miss? Right! Kitty! Cute job, Ellie! That looks awfully familiar, Matt! And now I know why! Sorry! Guess I'm taking this round then. <laughs> Being creative is more than drawing on a page. Um, are we done dancing yet? Because there are doggies to be drawn. This is gonna be interesting. Do I start with the ears? Matt, you need a little help? Ah, check out this doggy over here! What? A dog? Ah, forget it. Oh, hey, Ellie! See the doggy? Hey, I kind of see it now! It's like a Rottweiler! I can just trace it on here! And I can add my own details! 
Like its little doggy color. And what's a dog without sweet eyes? Time for the wet nose. And a long tongue. And the right pops of color. <sighs> Turn this thing into a real piece of art. Man, I'm good. I just need a little extra help. I don't think this will work either. How does this stuff even get in here? Seriously? This is what I was hoping for! Oh, such a good boy! And so handsome! Oh, he really is adorable! Oh, wait, no! Where's your art? Mine's ready, miss! I see I really inspired you! Yay! But now I just want to pet him. He really is soft. And last but not the least, purple. <laughs> uh -huh. Attention, please. We're not done here. We're drawing rainbows, huh? Let the games begin. Huh, can't forget this one. They always begin with red. See? Looking like a rainbow already. I'm not really into markers. Mind your own business! She's not even doing anything! Hey, is that a poppet? I love those things! And it's exactly what I need! Ha! Isn't it great? But I'm using it for something a little different. Each line gets its own color. Just a couple more here. There! Can't forget about the holes! Now for the quick flip! <sighs> Isn't this just so satisfying? Almost as satisfying as this! Teacher! Heads up! Hey! We're ready now! Wow! So many beautiful colors! Execution's a bit off! Okay... Now that's thinking outside the box! Well, I better get ready for class. Whoa, this is so cool. Hmm, what hairstyle should we choose? Not green. I think I know. We'll go for number three. Ugh, what is that supposed to be? Let go, it's mine. I want to see it. Whoa. What happened? You're finally here at last. Welcome to the art challenge. I guess we better get started. First up, we have… Drum roll, please! A rainbow! Wow! I love rainbows! Let's just get on with this. I need something for my bag. Ooh, I'll check my bag. What have I got? That's your bag? Aha! I can use it for my drawing. Hey, I forgot I had this. Mmm, it still smells good. Are you kidding me? I'm gonna throw up. Eh, I'm just messing. I just need a pen. A diamond encrusted pen, of course. Ugh, where did this come from? Hmm, that gives me an idea. Hey, Kendall! Get it away from me! Oh, so gross. Okay, I'll start by folding the paper. I'll place the pencil tin on it and use it to draw a circle. Then I'll draw a face on it. I'll start with the eyes. I'll split the smile over the folds. What a lovely smile. Now I'll open the paper up. I'll use my money as a ruler. I'll join up the face. Then it's time to add some color. I want it to be as bright as possible. And I'll draw a rainbow inside the mouth. Now I can fold the paper back over. It looks great! Check it out! It's pretty good, huh? Wow! My jaw is dropping! Brittany hasn't even started yet. There must be something I can use. Oh hey, I found my old chalk. I can definitely use this. I just need my trusty hammer. I'll quickly make a butterfly stencil. I'll place it on a sheet of black card. Next, I'll put the chalk on it. And then, it's bashing time! Oh yeah, that feels good! This really works out my tension. Now I can remove the stencil. I'm left with a beautiful butterfly. Excellent work, girls! I know! It's such a tough decision, but Brittany wins! Really? Wow, thanks! Ugh, that's so unfair! Hey, I like your drawing. 
Hey, romance is in the air. Here's your next challenge. It's a love heart. And to inspire you, I have a special guest. Take a look over there. Hello, ladies. I call this my smoldering look. Gee, I'm so glad I brought that wind machine. Ah, he's cute. Hey, I saw him first. Nuh-uh. I need to win this round. I'll have to create something special. Give me the love hearts. I want more. I'm going as fast as I can. I'm not good under pressure. Here you go. This is just what I need. Brian is so dreamy. We'd be so happy together. Okay, let's do this. I'll start with a romantic message. I think that says exactly how I feel. Now I'll go around it with a gold pen. I'll add some stars. I wrote messages on the other hearts. Hmm, I think I'll choose this one. I'll fold the sides. And press them down to create a crease. Now I'll fold the top over. It makes a small envelope. I'll use a sticker to seal it. I'll put it with the rest. It's a little collection of love letters. It makes the cutest key ring. Whoa, that's pretty good. Hmm, this might be tougher than I thought. I'm struggling to think of something. Okay, here goes. I'll draw a love heart. But it's not a conventional love heart. It's different, but it looks good. Hello there. I'm loving the hobo look. And this drawing? Say magnifique. A rose for a rose. Wow, such a gentleman! And what's this? Is that for me? Beautiful and talented. What a combo. I have something for you. Ah, he's still my heart! Yeah, I get that reaction a lot. Ahem. Anything for me? Be quiet, this is my time! This is handy. Just a little joke. The next challenge is… A brush. Uh, where's Brittany? Don't look at me. Whatever. Let's start without her. Go ahead. This should be easy. Hello. I want an order. What great service. I love shopping. It's my favorite hobby. Okay. Let's get this out of the box. How did it even fit in here? Ugh. It's heavy. But it's perfect. I don't need this box anymore. Sorry I'm late. <laughs> Oh my gosh, is that toilet paper? Huh? What are you talking about? Oh, right. Oops. Well, that was embarrassing. So what did I miss? Wait. I just need to do something. Please stop. Oh yeah, that feels good. Oh, I can use this. I don't need a paintbrush. I'll snap it in half. Then I'll roll it in toilet paper. I want to keep it nice and tight. Next, I'll wrap it in green plastic. Just like this. Once that's done, I need a sticker. This will hold it in place. It looks good. I'll place it into this clear tube. I think it's ready. I'll dip the first swab into pink paint. It matches the color of the plastic. And then I'll brush it onto the paper. When I'm done with that color, I just swap the swabs around. It's time for some blue. I'll let the paint absorb into the swab. And I can get back to creating my art. What the? So it's like that, is it? You ain't seen anything yet. I have big plans. I'm about to create a masterpiece. I'm finished! Uh… What? Why would you do that? You lose! Come on! The brush slipped! Sorry. Gotta keep my potassium levels up. This is the next challenge. All this work is making me hungry. Get me something to eat! Ooh, this is more like it. It all looks so delicious. What should I try first? Whoa, that does look good. I want it! Get your grubby hands off it! I don't want you touching my food! Come on, you won't eat all of it! Fine, I'll give you an egg. Catch! Whoa, easy! Don't drop it! Phew, that was close. Thanks for this. I'll crack the egg into a bowl. I want to keep the yolk separate. I'll put that in another bowl. I'll use my fingers to break it. Hmm. It feels all slimy. Next, I'll add a small amount of oil. Just a little more. Now I can stir it. Next, I'll fill a syringe with the mixture. It makes it easier to work with. And it's not as messy. I'll add the egg mixture to powdered paint. I don't need a lot. 
just a few drops. I'll use a brush to mix the egg and paint together. That looks about right. Now I'll take the eggshell and crush it slightly. I want to break it into small pieces. I'll take this piece of the shell and I'll paint it blue. I love this color. I've drawn a vase and I'll stick the shell onto it. Then I'll add flowers. Mmm, I couldn't eat another bite. Wait. Maybe I eat too much? Whoa! Oops. My bad. Better out than in. I don't want to waste any food. Hmm, maybe I can create something with it. I've painted a sheet of card blue. And I'll use the broccoli as a brush. I'll dab paint over the paper. I'll use different colors. It gives an amazing leaf effect. Check it out! Ooh, that's pretty. I love it. Very creative. How do I decide? It's tough, but Kendall wins! Yes! I'm the greatest! Okay, take it easy, Picasso. Whee! Look at it go! Take a look at your next challenge. How exciting! Are you kidding? I've no idea what we're supposed to do with that. Aw, there's a loose thread on my shirt. There's another one. That's all I need. Hmm, maybe these might come in useful. Ooh, makeup! Maybe Kendall won't notice. This is my chance. Just act natural. Nothing to see here. The perfect crime. I'll cover the thread in strength. Then I'll put it on my notebook. I'll arrange it in a wave pattern. Then I'll close the notebook over. I'll pull the thread. It leaves behind an abstract painting. It looks great! Wow, that's actually quite impressive. Wait, Brittany? Yes? Oh, uh, how did that get there? Ugh. Keep it. I'll use this brush. I'll paint my canvas black, but I'll stop halfway. Then I'll apply a line of glue. I'll brush the glue over the black paint and the blank canvas. Just like this. Before it sets, I'll sprinkle glitter over it. I need to be quick. Phew, this is hard work. Huh? Is that gold? That'll look great on my painting! Even my dandruff is rich! I should buy better shampoo, though. I'll place a heart stencil onto the canvas. And grab a can of spray paint. I'll go over the stencil with it. It's so vibrant! I'll carefully remove the stencil. Wow! I'd hang that on my wall. It's good, isn't it? Oh yeah, wait until you see this. Whoa! My eyes! I can't see! Put it down! That's better. Wow, it's wonderful. It is pretty special. Give me a warning next time. Whoa, look at all this stuff. That's the end of the challenge. It's time to announce the winner. Me, me, pick me. I'm so nervous. Who will it be? It's Kendall. I don't believe it. I tried my best. Well done. Hmm. Wait. We should share the prizes. Really? You mean it? Woohoo! Uh, I'm not really a hugging person. It's so beautiful. Art is the real winner. Come on, and be quiet. I don't think we should be doing this. It's too late now. Ready? Whoa! Chocolate! Okay, follow me. Step where I step. Whoa! Shh! Are you okay? Well, she said I need to follow her. Whee! Thankfully, I landed on my hand. That could have hurt. Never mind that. We have the chocolate. Huh? That's not chocolate. I don't believe it. It's a drawing. No way. It's real. What happened? Where are we? Look! Art supplies! Guess we better get drawing! Okay, first challenge! I wonder what it is! Aw, what a cute puppy! Can we keep it? Okay, I can do this! Hmm, I've seen artists do this. No idea why, but it looks good. It's quite small for a puppy. Wait, I know what to do! Huh? I've got a hand too, big deal. Ah, I get it. This is easy. I'll trace around my hand. What are you doing? At least she's happy. I'll put my hand on the paper like this. Then draw around it. Now to make it look like a dog. Some fur, cute little eyes, and a nose. I'll add some color now. This is turning out well. Gotta stay in the lines. Almost finished. 
There! He's so adorable! I'm proud of that! I'll call him Lucky! That's actually quite good. I mean, I like mine, but… Wow. At least you tried. <laughs> Who won? Yeah! Look! Something's happening! Biscuits! Yummy! It's shaped like a bone! Genius! I love the dog theme. I can't wait to try it. Hold on. Biscuits? Bone? Dog? Stop! They're, they're not for you! Now these taste great! I need the recipe! Ooh, I wish you hadn't done that. What's uh. up? These biscuits! They're for the puppy! Could you not have told me that? Serves you right. Hey, come here, boy. We have goodies. Come on! Oh, who's the best boy? You are. Yes, you are. You must be hungry after all that posing. You're such a clever puppy. On you go. It's for you. Ooh, this is exciting! A unicorn! Hmm, this might be tricky. I'm going for the pens. I don't know, so many options. Paint… Or pens. Pens. I think this is the right choice. Okay, here goes. Oops! My pen slipped. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, it slipped. Okay. You're so immature. Let me help improve your drawing. Don't you do that again. I warned you! I improved it! Oh, you missed a spot! I'll help you color it in! Gah! This is pointless! Take that! Quit it! Stop it! We could do this all day long! Take some more paper! Fine, but I'm facing this way. I'm gonna draw the best unicorn ever! Got it! U N I C O R N. Now I just need to join it up. I'll give it a nice hairstyle. Can't forget the legs. All I have to do now is color it in. Pink will be the perfect color. I think this will win. I wish I had a real unicorn. All that's left is the tail. Done! That was easy. Ta-da! Oh no! Here's my drawing. It's… good. Well done. I wonder who won this round. <laughs> well, I'm shocked! Yes! What's the prize? Please be a real unicorn! I can live with that. This won't do. Too small. Let me see. Aha! That looks so tasty! Maybe I could try a little piece. She won't notice. This is what I need! Stand back! This is about to get messy! You didn't! Sorry, I tripped Anna. Uh, landed on the cake! I saved you some! You're unbelievable! I offered. Ready for the next challenge? A cactus? You're going down. I doubt it. You are. Go! This should be easy. Gotta keep my energy up. Feel no stress. You're one with the pen! I nearly finished! Done at last! Phew! Spot the difference. It's hard, isn't it? What is that? Watch and learn. I'll drag the sponge down the paper. Then use smaller sponge for the limbs. Now for the flowers. All I need to do is add some details. I might frame this afterwards. What do you think? Well, they're both green. Don't give up the day job. This isn't even gonna be a contest. Wow! A cactus pinata! Think there's candy inside? Only one way to find out! I'll put on this blindfold. Okay, time to work out some tension. Glorious! Look! Huh? Did you say something? Where did she go? Hello? <laughs> Meh. Her loss. What happened? <gasps> hey! Where did this candy come from? I've got a good 
feeling about this one. Well, that's disappointing. I thought this was a challenge. Okay, what should I use this time? Too big. Nah, I'm not feeling it. This is perfect. A pumpkin should be straightforward. It's an orange circle. I need to win this one. Okay, this'll do. I'll start with the sections, then the stem. Now to fill it in. A different shade and color will make it look good. I'm happy with that. What do you think? Hey, wake up! Hello? Yoo-hoo! Wake up! We're supposed to be drawing! I'm awake! What's going on? Oh right, the pumpkin. Great, time's up! This is the best I can do. You've got a little something on your cheek. Really? What? Aw, paint. It suits you. Yes! What's the prize? Mmm! Pumpkin juice? This isn't nice. I… I feel funny. What's happening? Do I have a pumpkin for a head? Ah! At least you have a costume for next Halloween. <laughs> I hate this game! Ah! My face! My beautiful face! It's back! Oh, sorry, I got a fright. I'm never drinking this again. Hey, keep it over there. Hey, look! Last! A poppet! Wow! This is the best one yet! I need this to look amazing! First I'll draw a square. Then circles. I've got a better idea. Luckily I keep this photocopier handy. Okay, poppet. In you go. And press copy. I couldn't have done it any better. How you get it on? That's it! I just need to color it now! Ooh, this'll be fun! I'll put a line of red paint here. Now the rest! It's like a rainbow! It's just like a poppet. I want to press it! Good job! I think I might have won this one. No way! I did it! You've got to be kidding! Look at mine! Step away from the table, ma'am. Give me your hand. And the other one. Don't resist. Using a photocopier is not drawing. We take cheating very seriously here. Sorry? <laughs> you think you know someone. Wow! A chocolate poppet! My two favorite things! Delicious! Okay, you're going downtown. Come on. Uh-oh. Whatever. Uh, is that thing really necessary? I don't have anything on me. I swear. Enough with the lies. Ah, uh, totally busted. I'm definitely gonna fail now. Now go! Well, this day's off to a rough start. But she forgot to check one spot. <laughs> Sucker. Oh, look at my baby. All grown up. If only these kids were like him. Pick me, come on! I got it, I got it, please! What about you, Brian? My baby, come here. Uh, seriously? Oh, she always picks Brian. All right, Mom, I'm here. I don't know if I know this one. Three times two is six. 
Uh, so, I guess the answer's five? That's gotta be it. Um, that would be a no. Really? Put a one in there. Oh, I gotcha. There. My cute little smarty pants. Sign my test. Wow, thanks. Mwah. I can't believe I did that. I can get used to this. I now crown you king of the school. Sweet. This mother teaching thing is really working out. Uh, those eyes better be down. Ah, oh, thank goodness I studied. Why did I stay up playing video games? Freaking out here. Hey, want to help me out here? Okay. Number one is 250. Two is 65. Uh, do I hear whispering? Those little cheaters. Shh. Like they can trick me. I'll have to do this another way. I don't have to say a single word. Uh-oh. Behave, or I'll fail you both. Ah, oh, that was bad. Wait a second. The solution's so obvious. Psst. Watch my hands. Different spots mean different letters. I get it. Okay, uh, what's number one? A. And, and number two? What's going on over there? I'm uh, just feeling my own groove. Okay. I can get down with that funk. Found it. These notes sure are thorough. Mmm, blueberry. Brian? What's with all the candy? Away, please. Yeah, party's over. Rose. What? So judgmental. Could these two backpacks be any different? See ya. Just gotta make a quick locker stop. No one's watching, right? Just need one thing. Gah! Oh. oh no! Betty? Nothing to see here. Stop staring at it, okay? Oh, Betty. You're a trash stasher, too? <laughs> see this? Why not make it useful? Magnets can do wonders, see? You can have a bunch for different things. And now you're organized. Thank you, Brian. Let's go. Ah, where is that thing? Hey, uh, do you have water? Oh, no problem. Just gotta move a few things around. It's in here somewhere. Careful, Betty. This is getting ridiculous. Uh, wait, just another second. You sure carry a lot of clothes around. I'm definitely getting closer. I have plans. Come on. Seriously, Betty? Found it. Try this next time. Take a t-shirt and a bra and cover it with these. Fold the t-shirt up, then roll it like a burrito. And last but not least, grab a sock and turn it inside out. Stick your hand in and grab the clothes. Pull the fabric over everything so that it completely envelops the wrap. Look how much better it fits. And you have room for more stuff. It's a backpack game changer. Check it out. Oh, how can I ever thank you? So smart. Oh, we better head to class. Pencils down, Tess up here. I couldn't come up with anything. Gah. Thank you. Brian, time's up. Huh? Uh, desperate times call for desperate measures. Mm. Just a couple letters can send a major message. K 
Can you guess what it is? Alrighty, all done. Here you go, ma'am. Let's see. <laughs> oh, well, isn't this the sweetest? Talk about a confidence boost. And I'll send a message right back. Mwah! How's this? All done grading, Brian. Yeah? Wait, it, is that a... Is that an F? Ah. 